Under the clear blue sky of the Salinas Valley, California, where vast fields stretch endlessly to the horizon. Broccoli is more than just an ordinary vegetable. It is a symbol of American agriculture. With over 1 million tons harvested annually, this region supplies more than 80% of the broccoli consumed across the United States. Behind every lush, green broccoli head lies the dedication and hard work of farmers who seamlessly blend tradition with modern technology to optimize yields. From tiny seeds sown into nutrient-rich soil to thriving under the warm sunlight, every stage of broccoli cultivation tells a story of commitment, skill, and pride passed down through generations. Broccoli not only provides excellent nutritional value, but is also a familiar ingredient in many dishes. But have you ever wondered how farmers manage to produce those fresh, delicious broccoli heads? In today's video, join us as we visit the largest broccoli production center in the United States, where fields are tended under the best conditions, producing high quality broccoli, and also a place that holds the pride of people dedicated to agriculture. In the U.S., broccoli is typically planted in early spring and late summer, thanks to its ability to thrive in cool climates. The ideal temperature for its growth ranges from 55 to 75 degrees Fahrenheit, providing favorable conditions for farmers to harvest abundant crops. Soil preparation is one of the most crucial steps in determining the quality and yield of broccoli. Before planting, American farmers till the soil to improve aeration and remove weeds. The soil's pH is carefully adjusted to between 6.0 and 7.5, creating an optimal environment for root nutrient absorption. To promote rapid growth, organic matter and fertilizers rich in nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium are added in balanced amounts. In addition, advanced irrigation systems are installed to maintain consistent moisture, ensuring quick seed germination and strong seedling development. Thanks to the combination of hands-on farming experience and scientific research, broccoli varieties are continually improved to be more disease-resistant and productive. Scientists focus on breeding varieties that can withstand common threats such as downy mildew, fusarium fungus, and leaf spot while maintaining their signature quality and flavor. Depending on the climate, Farmers can either plant seeds directly in the field or start them in greenhouses before transplanting them outdoors. The seeds are carefully selected to ensure high germination rates and strong disease resistance. When sown, seeds are placed at a depth of about 0.5 inches, spaced 12 to 18 inches apart to provide ample room for growth. In the transplanting method, healthy seedlings about 4 to 6 inches tall are transferred from nursery trays to the fields, shortening the growing cycle.
After planting, the soil is lightly watered to maintain moisture and encourage germination. During the initial days, an optimal temperature range of 55 to 75 degrees Fahrenheit helps young plants establish strong roots before entering a rapid growth phase. As the broccoli plants develop, their roots and leaves expand quickly, improving their ability to absorb water and nutrients. During this stage, watering, fertilizing, weeding, and pest control are routine tasks that must be carried out regularly. Today, with advancements in technology, drones are used to spray pesticides over broccoli fields. These drones fly smoothly, evenly distributing nutrient-rich fertilizer solutions onto the leaves quickly and efficiently. If pest infestations go beyond control, they can destroy an entire crop within days. Farmers use specialized machines to remove weeds from broccoli fields without harming the plants. These machines significantly reduce manual labor and increase productivity, making them essential tools for modern broccoli farming. Gradually, the broccoli head begins to form at the center of the plant, small at first but growing rapidly, becoming dense and taking on a deep green color. When it reaches the standard size of about six to eight inches, with tightly closed buds, farmers must harvest it immediately to ensure the best quality. A delay of just a few days can cause the buds to bloom, reducing the crunchiness and commercial value of the crop. Broccoli harvesting is primarily done by hand by skilled farm workers. Using sharp knives, they cut each broccoli head at the base, ensuring clean cuts that minimize plant damage. Once harvested, the broccoli heads are placed directly onto conveyor belts or specialized transport trucks to be swiftly moved off the field, preventing bruising and moisture loss. Despite advances in technology, mechanical harvesting of broccoli is still uncommon. The unique structure of the vegetable requires precise cutting, making manual harvesting more effective. Additionally, the investment cost for automated harvesting systems remains high, making it less feasible for many farming operations. After leaving the field, broccoli undergoes a strict post-harvest process to preserve its freshness. Some of the harvest is processed into frozen broccoli, a convenient option that retains its original flavor and nutrients. The floors are blanched at 185 minus 100 degrees Fahrenheit for one to three minutes to eliminate bacteria and preserve their vibrant color before being rapidly frozen using IQF individual quick freezing technology. This method ensures that each piece is frozen separately, preventing them from sticking together.
For fresh broccoli, processing and packaging are carried out quickly to maintain its natural crispness. The hydrocooling method, widely used in large California farms, plays a key role in post-harvest preservation. This technique involves spraying cold water directly onto the broccoli or submerging it in ice water, rapidly lowering its temperature to 30 to minus 36 degrees Fahrenheit within minutes. This process helps maintain texture, freshness, color, and nutrients while slowing down enzyme activity and bacterial growth, preventing spoilage. Next, the broccoli heads pass through sorting lines, where both workers and machines inspect their size, color, and bud density to select only the highest quality produce. After grading, broccoli is trimmed and packed into specialized bags or boxes with humidity control systems for optimal storage. It is then stored in cold warehouses and transported to supermarkets, markets, and restaurants. The entire process, from harvest to delivery, is completed within 24 to 48 hours, ensuring that broccoli reaches consumers at peak freshness. And there you have it, a fascinating journey into the world of broccoli. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button, share it with your friends, and leave a comment below. Subscribe to the channel so you won't miss our upcoming videos. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next video.